Good morning, you guys. Woman Crush Wednesday. I don't know who I'm going to put up today. Probably myself. <laughs> but anyway, you guys, I just came on really quick. I know it's dark because, you know, time has changed. But a couple of things. I want to start doing like a story time uh, with you guys, telling you some things that may have happened in my life, whether it was recent or old. Um, and I have two stories that I want to tell right now, but I want a title to it, you know. Like I named some of my videos Danger Zone or Not Candy Cody Talk. This one is more of a, a story time. Like, so if anybody has some ideas for a name of the segment, like, you know, for example, Miss QT Style Chronicles or Chronicles of Miss QT Style, whatever like that. I kind of like want, want something unique and original. And for a lot of my subscribers that's been down with a sister for a long time, you guys, I want to give you guys the opportunity to um, maybe... Um, name it and when you do of course I'm gonna shout you out and plus I'm, I want to send you a little something for helping me out because I just can't seem to get it and I want it to be a simple name a quick name because I'm gonna title it title the story time that and then I'll tell you guys what it's about like for example if it was Chronicles of Miss QT style um, food for less mess I, I have a story to tell you guys about food for less you know I'm gonna have that title but then tell you what it is so if you guys can help a sister out with that I would greatly appreciate it also I am thinking about changing my name even though you know a lot of people I've been Miss QT style since I've been on here and I stuck with that and I am gonna always be uh, Miss QT style in my mind um, but I was thinking about changing my name a little bit like to maybe glammy glam or glam Tell me what you guys think. Are you do you think I should just leave it as Miss Cutie Style? I mean, I like the name. I've made a name. You know, I started out coming out, you know, Miss Cutie Style, a leading lady, it's star, Hollywood type theme and stuff like that. And it's a wrap. So maybe I should stick with Miss Cutie Style, but I don't know. Glammy Glam Miss Cutie Style, Glammy Miss Cutie Style. I don't know. I want to maybe change it, but if not, I'm cool with that. But I definitely need a uh, title to story time. So let me do my, my first one and I, I'm already calling it story time But I don't don't want to title with that because someone else has that but I'm just I was giving an example Of what I will be doing which is basically telling a story. So but this first story is you guys So Angie Stone and beat her daughter ass right <laughs> Wow. Anyway, you guys, I don't even want to hear that. I hate to hear about mothers and daughters doing that. Um, my first, um, yeah, food for less mess. We're gonna call this food for less mess. Now, me and my daughter, uh, Friday, was it Friday when we came from the? Yeah, when we came from the um, Jean Pierre's office visit, we went to food for less, and it's just so funny how people. Uh, food for less is a grocery store so it's so funny how some people just come in a store with attitudes and do like rude things and you deal with just like crazy ass people now the first one up is a chick me and her was at the chick you know how they have the little island i guess in the middle of the like by the meat and they have like meat in there you know some of it's against the wall but this was an island it had some chicken in there okay i was on this side okay she was over there looking at something else soon as i came on this side and was looking at chicken drumettes she was on the other side she gonna reach way okay this 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 here ain't gonna um this ain't gonna be cool for my story time all this damn noise they, i wish they fixed this street man well i don't know maybe i should start this story another time because this noise gotta go and i'm already in four minutes in and I gotta wait to get over. Anyway, I was on this side. She was on this side. So I'm on my side looking at a meat. There was a thing of a meat right here. Do you know that she was on that side? She reached way across. Look at my hand. And grabbed that meat that... Y'all, everything is fucking up. My story little thingy. All right, you guys. I just messed up my whole thing because all of this noise, this fucking street. See, this is this is the fucking thing right here. People be trying to do shit, and you got all this going on. They just done fucked up my little story right here. Like, what the hell? 
Damn. Okay, I'm going to have to come back, you guys. I can't do it right now because it's got too much going on. Ambulance, fire trucks, the street and stuff. So, anyway, I guess y'all wondering and probably what happened. I'll come back. Shit. Okay, let's try this again really quick. So anyway, she was over there. I was over here. She, I'm looking, I, I, didn't, I hadn't even touched the meat yet, but I was going to it and she could tell I was going through. She reached way over there, you guys, and grabbed that one chicken, pack of chicken that I was looking at. She jerked it and she threw it in her basket and she started walk on. Y'all, all I could do was buzz out and laugh, but she, she had earphones in the ear. So it was like, bitch, me and my daughter cracked up. It was, well, I don't understand why she did that. What, bitch, you ain't getting that chicken. Or, you know, a lot of women, I don't know, for some reason, they mad dog me sometimes in the store when I'm dressed and when I'm walking. I've heard, had some say that they, like, I think I'm too much or I'm stuck up or whatever. You know, it's not that. I'm not, I'm not ratchet. I'm not, um, ghetto fabulous. Um, I'm not gonna come in the store with my pajamas on like they be up in there with, with a dirty uh, uh slippers and stuff like that and acting all ratchet. So I don't know what her problem was, but this bitch me, she she was like, give me that chicken. Y'all should have seen her. No words, but it was like, bitch, you just you just um you ignored all those other pack of chicken drum to take that one. She didn't you know how you look at me to make sure you want it, or maybe the price she didn't did none of that. She wanted my meat. That bitch wanted my chicken. Boy, I laughed so much up in that store at her. You know, I didn't even get mad about it because it was sad. Ratchet bitch. Okay, so moving right along, we go around to the um the drink section to get my diet drinks and stuff. There's this chick, she's just like She's bought a beer and she, I don't know, she just looks suspicious to me, okay? Every time we walk, she walk. And I have a tendency to carry a big purse and my purse is always open. Look, it's open right now. My purse, I don't know why I don't, my daughter tell me that all the time. So I'm like, is this bitch trying to put something in my purse? And I also had Sean Pierre diaper bag on me. So I'm like, what is she doing? Is she trying to steal out my purse? She's trying to put something in my purse? But then I, I caught, I started thinking, no, this bitch probably trying to steal some beer. She had a, uh some type of 24 hour can of beer that bitch trying to steal some beer and she was using us as a shield that's the only thing i can see but she was getting on my nerve creeping behind me so i stopped dead and i looked at the bitch like what then she just smiled and went on like bitch don't be creeping and uh, creep cropping it uh behind me and stuff like that these people be killing me so then i go to the front of the line oh i go get in the line um there's this chick she's checking out in front of us and I guess she decided she wants some gum I'm putting my groceries up the basket right there she gonna squeeze herself beside the basket damn near pushing my basket I ain't saying excuse me got some little funky looking shorts on that she didn't cut up you know tried to make the style but half our ass she hanging out rubbing our ass up against my basket standing there like just you know she could have said excuse me I would have backed up or whatever this bitch just like busting through I ain't never moved bitch you can't say excuse me then I'm not moving okay I said okay now that one I almost mean how I almost got into it because I almost like you know you can't say excuse me me and my daughter just look at each other you know but I'm, I'm learning to calm down a bit because you know I'm gonna have my grandbaby you know when I'm babysitting and he was with us so I'm learning to, to, to put it on chill but these motherfucking bitches and foods for less was looking for some mess okay so then we checking out we have to bag our own groceries right there's this man he lurking y'all he's lurking and he looked like he's out of it he's lurking in front of the fucking um in front of where we checking out at and it's like he just lurking he wouldn't move he wouldn't move and i'm wondering what the hell is he doing what he doing come to find out once i'm leaving out the store he was with this and people gonna get pissed off with me because of the video i did about interracial and stuff about how some of these women be looking at some of these men black men got but i have to say he was a mess too but she was a fucking mess both of them look like they been drinking beer for a whole motherfucking uh, week. He was waiting on her. So I don't know if he was trying to uh, um, get attention so people can see him with her or if his ass was looking to steal something too. Because he kept just picking, he just kept, he just looked suspicious. Okay, so then me and my daughter start walking off. All of a sudden, he start fucking walking. I stop. We stop. See, that's how I test them. I'm like, okay, because I want to see if they really doing what they need to do or if they're trying to do stuff. I walk again. This motherfucker start walking. So I did him the same thing like I did old girl. I stopped. Then his ass went on. Okay, we left out the store, got in our car, and when we passing back, he coming out the store with his drunk as um, white girl by the basket, 
probably got more they probably got more beer up in that bag and stuff like that so it's like i'm like you know what damn you can't even go in the store no more without possibly getting into mess with certain people but i'm learning i'm learning to just let little things roll by but to me all of them was rude old girl with the chicken was funny ratchet bitch <laughs> that whole one in my chicken that whole one i wish that fucking chicken i wish that fucking chicken burnt when she cooked it because that bitch skip all those chickens on her side to smack and y'all she's smashing it threw it in her fucking basket fucking chicken snatcher <laughs> ratchet chicken snatcher anyway you guys <laughs> food for less than that so that's all i wanted to tell y'all i'll be back with some more and remember if you got a title for my little little happenings or whatever please put it under the video and um so i can know who who said it and then i'm gonna pick a name and that's the one i'm gonna go with and then i'm gonna ask for your address of course so i can send you a little something something yeah y'all I escaped some mess and food for less. Right? What, and what y'all? What you think we should call old girl with the chicken? Ratchet chicken snatcher? Well, what we should call her? She need a name. Y'all should have seen it. Y'all, I wish I could have asked the people for a recording of camera. Me and my daughter, I died laughing, and she kind of looked and just rolled her eyes because she knew what we was laughing at. But then I noticed when she walked off, she went to the cheese. She went to the um by the bacon. She was just taking stuff and throwing it. Just, just, just ugh. Like what you throwing that for? That shit. That fucking, that bitch should have threw a bread or something. Her bread gonna be smashed, all of that. But I I hope that fucking chicken burnt since she wanted my motherfucking chicken. And I didn't even get no chicken. I was looking. Because that them damn drum ass is always expensive. So I'm looking at the cheapest pack, the better looking pack, and shit like that. This bitch is, mm, mm, fucking ratchet chicken snatcher. <laughs>